Welcome back to another vlog. Today is Sunday and it also happens to be Halloween. I am actually headed to Universal Studios for their Halloween Horror Nights. I'm going with my best friend Jared. Obviously last year I didn't do anything or dress up and I love dressing up. Horror Nights at Universal Studios is like one of my favorite things in the world. Like haunted houses, I mean I freaking die. My friend Jared will like throw himself on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> when the actors jump out and just like be super dramatic and hysterical so it's just like dying laughing screaming just like i'm not gonna have a voice tomorrow he came over a few days ago and brought like a glue gun and a bunch of rhinestones and stuff and we made matching t-shirts this year i'm so so excited because it's actually cold it's like 60 degrees in la 60 degrees in la is like winter every other year on halloween it's like 80 degrees out and it just like it just doesn't feel right I am very excited. But yeah, I'll show you the t-shirts that we made. <laughs> so we both got these purple t-shirts. I cut mine into a crop top and this is hilarious, but he got, it was supposed to be an M, but the store was added the letter M. So he got me a W and I just put it on upside down. Um, he has his initial and then we both just like put rhinestones all over. I'm also gonna wear this like puffy jacket from Zara. It's very cute. I really like the sleeves on it. They're like super puffy and they have these little drawstrings to tighten the sleeves. And yeah, let's go get scared. Thank you for your cooperation. Halloween, best Halloween ever. After two years of being away, we are back. We're Universal back. Studios hooked it up. We are skipping the lines. Thank you, Uni Studios and Halloween Horror Nights. It is amazing. We are back and better than ever. That's right, Halloween Horror Nights and oh my god we feel fulfilled we were frightened frightened to death we were scared we were running like maniacs and it turned out we're the final girls we're the final girls and we got souvenirs show us your shirt Leatherface my favorite serial killer the Texas Chainsaw Massacre that's right and I got Michael Myers Halloween 4 I hope you guys enjoyed watching us get our scares on and I hope you guys had a wonderful Halloween. Bye! So it's a couple days after Halloween and as you guys saw, we had a blast. So I've spent the last couple days kind of just chilling and honestly, I realized that all of October I didn't watch any Halloween movies so I kind of binged Halloween movies on Monday and Tuesday. And today I'm doing something super exciting. I'm going to pick up a foster dog and she's a husky and she's so so cute and i'm super excited because we haven't had a foster in a few months because my dog was sick with cancer and he did pass away almost two months ago and it's been really hard you know if you've ever lost a dog you know it's like a wave of emotions where you know what you're sitting in the fetal position on the ground sobbing i felt like i was ready to you know help out another dog that is in need and it's just obviously 
my dog was my whole life he was everything to me i loved him i still love him so much and you know he was with me for 11 years by my side 24 7 and not having him around has been like the absolute worst feeling that i think i've ever felt in my life and and i think like such a hard part of it has been just the quiet i'm you know like i'm so used to all his little noises and like hearing his nails walking on the ground hearing him stretch and you know just like feeling his presence at all times and you know more than anything like he would follow me around the apartment and he would lay down wherever i was so it's like i never felt alone he was always there so it's been almost two months now and i think like two weeks ago was the first time that uh, my boyfriend and I decided to go for a walk outside and we were just walking down the street, you know, same streets that we would take him out on walks and we're just like looking at spots that remind us of him on our street and we're just like walking and I was like, oh, look at us, this two dogless losers on a walk. I, I don't understand anybody who can live without a dog. I truly can't. I don't know how like dogs just like fill a void so if you don't have a dog you've thought about getting one get one i'm heading out now i'm gonna go over to the rescue and pick up a crate and some toys and a leash and stuff and i'm gonna go pick her up So the last time I left off this vlog was when I was picking up a foster, which I did, and she was an adorable husky named Shadow, and I think I only got like one clip of her before she was reunited with her dad. So Shadow's story was that she was living with a homeless man in LA, and sadly he fell asleep, or I don't know what the situation was, and Shadow ended up taking off, and she started following some guy on the street who was walking his dog and basically asking for help. He grabbed Shadow and called the rescue that I fostered through and they were able to scan a chip luckily which is how they ended up finding him and they couldn't get a hold of him for a couple days so that's how she ended up with me. He ended up showing up to the rescue and just like looking for her and it was a very happy reunion and they were so happy to see each other so I'm just glad that you know I was able to give her a safe place for a day. But as you can see behind me, we've already picked up another foster. This is Chase and he already has an adopter who is interested in him so hopefully he will also only be with me for a couple of days. He's a little anxious. We literally just picked him up so he's a little confused. Um, we're about to head home now and yeah. We are going to a band of horses show tonight. Yeah, wow, I really don't think I've been to a concert since before the pandemic. All right, well, anyways, we're going to a concert tonight. Very excited about that. I will bring you guys along. We have a pretty full day of shooting episodes for the Vegan View tomorrow, so I'll bring you guys along to that as well. Saturday today we are shooting for the vegan view and I'm vlogging. Say hi to Hannah. <laughs> Watch my vlogs. I'll post more than once every six months, I promise. I'll make a There's Alessandra. Looks like she's doing business as always. Oh. Thank you. This is how you get subscribers. Like, subscribe. <laughs> But luckily, one of our next videos is coffee related, so. Oh, and there's Hannah! Hi! <laughs> there's Joy, Hi. getting our taste test ready. Yay.
Um, this is super uncomfortable for me because I was not expecting to be in the presence of Taylor Swift herself. I'm uh, freaking out a little bit. I will take a picture with you. Oh my gosh! I will, yeah.